The introduction video ended up being pretty long, so I decided to make a second video where we're just going to go through one more example of proof by cases. And for this is an important proof by case because this is kind of the other type that you see in the first video. We did a lot with even and odd, and now we're going to do an example where we have to do the division, and that's a common one for um, proof by cases. So show that an integer n is not divisible by 3, show that if an integer n is not divisible by 3, then n squared plus equals 3k plus 1 for some integer k. So what are the cases, I'm going to try to think, well, what are the cases such that n is not divisible by 3? Well, case 1, you got to be creative here. If n is not divisible by 3, then n has to equal 3m plus 1, or case 2, n has to equal 3m plus 2. Those are the only integers that can are that are not divisible by 3. They have to be able to be written by this, this method, where m is an element of z, of course, in both situations. So those are the two cases that we have to prove. So we just start with that, and then we, make, we work out this problem and see what we get. So show them if an integer n is not divisible by 3. So case 1. So we're going to say n equals 3m plus 1. And now we basically solve by direct proof. So m is an element of z. Okay, so now I'm going to plug that into n squared. So n squared equals 3m plus 1 squared. You would FOIL that out. You should get 9m squared plus 6m plus 1. Okay, and now I'm trying to show that that equals 3k plus 1. Well, that's not bad because I can take out a 3 right here and I can get, I'll be left with 3m squared plus 2m plus 1. And I can write this uh, 3m squared plus 2m. Well, that could be my k because that's some integer, right? So this equals 3k, 3k plus 1. k is an element of z. So that proved it for um, case 1. Now case 2. So now we have n equals 3m plus 2, where m is an element of z again. Not, not an element of 2, it's an element of z. The integers. All right, so now we get n squared. Well, that's just going to be 3m plus 2, whole thing squared. And that ends up being 9m squared plus uh, 6m again, plus 4 this time. Okay, so what can I do here? I can take out my um, 3, so I get 3m, 3 times m squared. Well, I'm going to actually break it up first, so I'm going to break this into... 9m squared plus 6m because I know I want a 1 on the end right here so I'm going to do 6m plus 3 plus 1 and now I'm going to factor out my 3 so I'm going to take 3 out and I'll get 3m squared plus 2m plus 1 plus 1 and I know that this is an element of z so I, I can write that as k again and that equals 3k plus 1 and that's what we wanted to prove so k is an element of z again of course so we've done our proof. We've shown that for both cases, such that n is not divisible by 3, it has to be 3m plus 1 or 3m plus 2. And we showed that for both cases, n squared can be written as 3k plus 1 for some integer. So hopefully that makes sense, and let me know if you have any questions. Have a good one.